Rachel here okay, and today I have another video for you guys. Today's video I will show you guys my top 5 favourite hidden locations which are in GTA 5 online right now. Um, before the video starts I, I like to give a well, kind of a big thanks to one of my subscribers and one of my friends on PlayStation 4 because um, he's the one who said why don't you do a top 5 of your most hidden locations to one of your top five most favorite hidden locations and top five most uh, favorite glitches. Um, so I took um, I took that from him because he he offered he said that I could do it. Um, but yeah, I like to give a th big thanks to that guy. Um, the reason why he's my friend on PlayStation is because um, if you if a few of you don't read the description of my videos, then it does say. In the description of my PS4 name, it's um, Granny uh, G R A N N Y, and then the little like dash kind of thing, the little line, and then short leg one. So um, if you want to go and add me, and then we could possibly, I could possibly make a video with you um, if you want to. But yeah, guys, I like to give, I like to uh, thank that person. Um, for giving me the idea of doing that and yeah guys if you do like video please a like and let's go on with the video so guys coming in at, coming in, in at number one is basically um, this is a hidden location that I did in one of my previous videos like but by the time I upload this video this video it'll, be, it'll probably be like um, three days ago that I did a video on this um, it's basically where you can you need a helicopter to get to up to this location because there isn't a ladder to climb up to and yeah basically when you get a helicopter and land on that pad helicopter landing type of thing there that you can land on basically all you have to do is go up that uh, ladder there and then come up this ladder and then when you do you have to go up this ladder and when you get to the top you can have a look at the whole entire city of Los Santos basically um you can hide from bounties in here um they'll probably think that you're on the ground level because yeah they'll probably think you're on the ground because as you can see there is a bit there that you can um they'll probably think that you're down there and then they'll probably think that you're down here because there is a road there um but yeah you can hide on this ladder if people do um cut if people do find a way to get up here then you can probably just like hide behind this wall here and then just probably like have a shotgun right here and just like point it in their face and shoot their f shoot their head off when they do do that when they do come and find you if they do find you but um we're not <laughs> When I was saying that then, I never meant to j jump off, sorry, but um, when I was saying that, I noticed that there was a... Oh, okay. I noticed that there was all that there. I thought that was a ladder to get up here, but it doesn't seem like it because that, it just ends there, basically. But, hey yeah, guys, that was number one. Um, if you do want to go and check out that hidden location uh, that I did in the, my previous few videos, then go and check it out. Um, Hey yeah, guys, let's move on to the second hidden location. Okay, guys, coming at number, coming up at number two is basically um, it's a movie set. Probably a lot of you might know that uh, there is a movie set here, but um, there are a lot of places that you can actually go and search. Basically, if you do want to get to that that hidden location, it's on it's along this road here, and then basically you just you need to go up these sort of stairs basically um and then when you do come back here you will notice that there is a few there's a ladder um when you do go up this ladder it actually leads you to the top of the building where you can scope out los santos basically um make sure there's no one trying to kill you um basically you can do loads of cool videos on here I wouldn't really say, whoops, 
Whoops. <laughs> yeah, uh, basically I wouldn't really say it's a hidden location. Well, sort of it kind of is. It kind of is because like people people probably think that you're on a top level that no, you're on the floor when you're not um oh my god what <laughs> uh yeah basically people might think you're on the floor um you, there's loads of places that you can uh hide in there basically uh there's a load of hiding spots that you can hide in such as go up these stairs and it'll probably lead you to a load of houses basically um it is actually really cool how Rockstar have done this. I don't know if there is actually something like this in um, LA, in real life in Los Angeles. Um, I don't know if that there is actually a movie set because I've never been to America before. But uh, it is actually a really cool thing that Rockstar have done here. It's um, yeah, it's basically like I said before. It's a good place to scope out. Uh, to like see if there's no one trying to kill you um, but yeah guys that was hidden location number two and um, let's move on to number three guys coming off part number three is basically it's a hidden location at the airport I have actually made a video on this it's uh, if you do want to go and find it then basically just go and want just go all the way to the bottom of where I first started YouTube which was only like it was only like a few months ago say like three months ago i think wait no it wasn't it was like five months ago actually but um yeah just go and find that video if you want to see it or or just watch this part of the video but um basically this is a uh, a place where you can hide from bounties you can put a load of sticky bombs on that door i don't have sticky bombs with me because right now i am poor that rhymes I'm so uh, basi um, basically uh, there are basically drinks machines in it what the what just happens uh, basically this is a place to hide from bounties if you, bounties if you want to say if you've got a nine thousand dollar bounty and you've got nowhere to go and then there's this place where you can go where people will probably think uh, you're either on the um, Sorry about that guys, my um my controller ran out. Basically this is a place to hide from bounties where say if you got a nine thousand dollar bounty, uh you could pop pop people will probably think that you're on the roof because mostly people that I know don't know about this <gasps> sorry, uh po people 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 that I've met probably, uh, no, people that I've met ha don't know about this location. Uh, one of my friends showed it to me one time. Um, well, basically, it's a cool location to go when you're trying to hide from people, like, basically, 10-year-old people um, who are just trying to kill you, like, constantly, and it's really annoying. Just go and hide here because then you can hide from them. And then when you do go on the, the roof, if you have got a, I can't remember what it's called, an, advan an advanced scope on your sniper, then basically you can just hide at the front here. You can use your sniper to snipe people who are trying to either like come in and kill you or just basically you can be a dick and just kill people who are trying to either get a helicopter or a plane. So you guys, let's move on to hidden location number four. So guys, coming in, uh, coming up in, coming in at number four is a hidden location, another hidden location where I, which I had done before in one of my videos. It is at this location, sort of over here. Um, basically, as you can see, there's this ordinary type of thing here. But if you go and shoot these windows, you might know that you can actually go inside here and um hide from a load of people um cop you can hide from cops if you got a a really high bounty on you 
you can hide in here or if you got any bounty to be honest and there's a load of people trying to find you they might think that you're on the roof or you might they might think that you're like in this weird glitch um yeah so people might see through here they might not you might that you might have to hide behind here for them not to see you and then like when they walk around there you'll have to be really quick and like go behind here go either here or like go behind here basically but um yeah this is just another head location where you can just hide from a load of people hide a load of from a load of people who are trying to kill you basically but yeah guys let's move on to the fifth and final hidden location which i think is pretty good in gj5 online so guys the fifth and final hit hidden location this is actually my most favorite hidden location in gj5 online right now and then this is basically a um basically a cave that you can go to and explore and do cool and funny skits basically and um, to get into it you're gonna need uh, explosive which explosives which I don't have right now but um, that's what I'm gonna get I'm gonna get a grenade because that is cheaper than a sticky bomb hopefully it will explode and yes it did so basically to get into the hid location you're gonna need explosives either sticky bombs grenades uh, proximity mines or basically a um, any rocket launcher type of stuff but um, basically this is a cave where you can go into you can hide from people you can do cool skits in here I've re I've been seeing a load of people doing skits in here but uh, actually a, f a load of people that I know don't know about this hidden location which um, is actually pretty cool because hopefully those people will be able to see it and um, basically sometimes if you do go here there will be sometimes someone laying down there um, it doesn't happen all the time but I think it only happens in story mode so that's actually a pretty cool thing to go and see um, but yeah there's nothing much to say about this is this this is actually my most favorite one in gta 5 online right now um but yeah guys that's all there is to it so if you do like the video please leave a like and tell my channel good in the future please subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video peace